would say just go. Um, the peop- the, a lot of the people here are very supportive. There's a lot of people who know what they're doing. Um, the leaders and uh, guides who live here in Haiti are very knowledgeable. They are very helpful. And um, the leaders that we bring with us know, know a lot as well. And everybody's just very supportive. Um, we're very welcomed here in the country, at least what I have um, seen. So there's not, there's really not too much to worry about. Just come and experience it. Take each experience by experience. In City Soleil, you have the water truck, and people depend on that water truck. Um, and if if they do anything that the people who are running the water truck doesn't don't feel is acceptable, they will turn the water off and leave. So when you're doing water truck day in City Soleil, <laughs> it's it's really safe. People will not like try to harm you in any way. Well, a lot of people are concerned about the safety and think that they won't be safe in Haiti, but I just want to let them know that, like, honestly, I felt extremely safe the entire time. There's no moments where I felt uncomfortable or I felt unsafe in any sort of way. I don't think you're ever prepared for getting off the tap tap the very first time at a water stop. I just say to be open to any experience that you might have on this trip. It might not necessarily be on the itinerary, and a lot of the things that I've experienced here haven't been the big overall things that we've been doing each day. It's just been little little details or little encounters, um, whether that be holding a little baby for two minutes and just seeing a smile or um, looking out the window of the tap tap and um, seeing little kids wave to you, hello. Um, just be ready to fully embrace just every experience that um, God is drawing you to on this trip and just don't be afraid of what you might see or what you may encounter because it'll impact you um, probably more than you might think at the moment. People look angry but they're usually not. That's a actually a very big tip. Is people don't look very, like people don't look very friendly but then you just just gotta say bonsoir to them and then they get this big grin on their face and they're just like oh bonsoir if anyone is like worried about the trip just know that you get so much out of it and you would never expect to have such good feelings about the trip during it and after it well like any experience that puts you outside your comfort zone you should experience it for yourself um, you find out more about who you are and, and ultimately I guess that is the end goal to find out who you are so you can be more true to yourself and feel more comfortable in, in your skin so you can share your gifts and your resources with the rest of the world.